My name is uh, David Mianskum. I'm from Stasny. I've always been here. Uh, there's been uh, our ancestors uh, hold this land. There's been a, a, a chain of us, and now uh, I am uh, still here. I'm still hunting here. Oh, go, 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 go. Uh, it's, it's always been my, my livelihood, uh, uh, making a living from hunting, uh, uh, doing things uh, outdoor, and going in the lake, uh, uh, fishing. It's always been my, my livelihood. It's, it's always been my way of life. Yeah. ああ、別にさ。ああ、別にさ。ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ
I I never got this, to know my my father. I was probably uh, I, I was told I was one year old when my uh, father passed away. So I never got the chance to learn uh, the hunting and trapping and the fishing activity from my father. I was raised by my mother. My mother raised me. And I also had a, a brother by the name of Blasio. Blasio cared for me. He was my older brother. And Blasio would always take me in the bush in the hunting camp. But he would uh, allow me to do little chores, the chores of cutting wood, the chores of getting boughs and camp maintenance. But he would only take me to a, a small, small uh, trips. He would never take me to a long trip because I was still a, a very young boy then. But I also had uh, other people teach me uh, how to become a hunter, how to become a trapper. Uh, for instance, there was an elder named Matthew Nipos. He's the elder that taught me how to trap, the trapping aspect of how to create a life. He showed me many methods and many systems of trapping. But I also had a, a brother-in-law, Lawrence Capio. Lawrence was uh, my teacher for moose hunting, like big game hunting. Lawrence is a, a very good uh, moose hunter. I learned uh, the moose hunting skills from uh, Lawrence Capio, who was my uh, brother-in-law. But I also had a, another brother-in-law, uh, Jimmy, Jimmy Kunkum. Jimmy, uh, he was a very good on snowshoe. He liked to chase, chase animals, especially lynx. He was a very good, uh, when he chased lynx, he would always get his lynx. I've never done that until Jimmy taught me how to do it. And in fact, he forced me. One day we seen this lynx, lynx fresh tracks. He asked me to chase it. I said, no, I cannot do it. He said, no, you go, chase it. If you can't get it, I'll help you. We'll get the lynx. Much to my surprise, uh, I went after that lynx and I got him not too far. Since then, uh, I started to learn how how to chase on snow. So, uh, 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 lynx and other animals like moose. So th there are different styles of hunting I learned from different people. Whenever we, uh, whatever we harvest uh, from the land, uh, we share that with the family. We share that with friends in the community. There are uh, many Crees who cannot uh, hunt uh, uh, like he does because they are working. So they too are, are really uh, uh, desperate for, uh, for wild food. So therefore, whatever we harvest is shared among family members here. And it's also shared with the community members in Stasny. Matsota, the Viscaris, Miguel Chem Dojano, Ino Jano, 
The livelihood is a, uh, it's a very important to him. Uh, he feels that uh, the livelihood of, of a hunter, traditional hunter, uh, was given by Creator. The Creator gave him that life to live. That's why I, I highly honor it and respect that, that way of life, being a hunter. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm-